Now I know what you're thinking, Rom. I can't believe you're actually taking the time out to check out this stupid game. I'm not talking about Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I'm still a fan of the game. I'm talking about Dragon Ball Card Warriors. And you might be asking yourself, what the hell is Card Warriors? I only got, I only got Kakarot. Everybody has this. So this is actually a free update that was released in the past week. And basically, the best way to describe it is if Dragon Ball Z had a, uh, uh, a baby with Hearthstone. A lot of you guys might not know what Hearthstone is, but to those who do, uh, Hearthstone was a card game that came out many, many years ago. And this literally is a direct clone to that game. It's funny, I even made a joke the other day. Someone commented on my video, was like, Ryan, if you end up touching this game, I'm going to unsubscribe. And I even jokingly said, You know what? I'm never going to play it. Don't worry. Until I tried it out and I realized, oh, this game is actually fun. Why is this not a free game on PSN? Why is this tied behind Dragon Ball Z Kakarot? And to answer that question, I don't know. But here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do one video today on this. I'm going to hop in and show you basically how to play. The tutorial is pretty easy if you want to check out for yourself. It's like four steps. And, uh, and then I'm going to do a, a match online against like a random person. But if you if you do want to see this come back on the channel at least at one point, maybe a, me and Nana will do like a, a, a video where we fight each other. Then we'll do that. But outside that, let me know your thoughts on Dragon Ball Card Warriors. So without further ado, let's uh, let's do some summons first. So I already did the tutorial. Uh, I don't know much what we can do in this game. I assume you get currency by just playing. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hop in the shop real fast and, and then do some summons. I think I can do like five multis on like the regular uh, banners. And I think I can do like two premium summons because that's what you get for just loading into the game. Okay, I guess we're doing this one. We're doing uh, a single card summon with 10 cards. Let's see what happens. This is my first time doing this. I know Nano did a video on this, but I didn't actually watch it. I was actually talking to him on Discord when his video went live. And they kind of gave me the basics on it, but let's see what happens. So we're not gonna hit the skip button. I like the animation on this. It's very much like a vending machine, it's, which is kind of dope. Hey, don't bet in the car. I'm trying to get them, them good grades when I send it off to PSA. Aider. Oh, there's more. Just, ooh, we got Frieza? So, hold on. Is that the rarity? Where does, where does it say what the rarity is? Is it just a... Oh, it's four stars. So, we got four star rarity in that one. Uh, one star. One star. More one stars. Two stars. Typical rhyme style summon, isn't it? <laughs> we were getting nothing out of this. Okay, so we're going to hop in and do another one. All right, here we go. I don't want to skip this animation because it's kind of cool. It gives me like that feeling of like actually putting my quarters into a machine and then the cards pop out. Hey, but I'm telling you, you better not scratch my hollow foil. All right, what we got? We got uh, Yamu, trash, <laughs> trash, two stars, but trash, two star trash. Woo, let's go. We got a four star. That actually, uh, I assume this is good. Deal seven times damage to your opponent's leader or one character on the field. Okay, that's nice. So every card has also effects kind of like Yu-Gi-Oh does, which is kind of dope. Uh, two stars. One star, trash, garbage, and then that's it. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and just go for rarity first. So, okay, so it looks like those two cards I got were the highest rarity. So, <laughs> I got two legendary cards in my first video. Let's go. I'm over here thinking, like, I got some bad cards. All right, what does he actually do? So, we got uh, KO's, all, KO's all characters on the field? Are you serious? That's going to my deck. Okay, what does this one do? Okay, I already read it. That's one of the 7,000 damage to the leader and one other card. So we're going to put that on my deck. And I think, so they're so they're actually very expensive. So it takes 10 energies to use the Frieza and 4 to use the Goku. So what I think what I'm going to do is this. Yeah, remove that. And I, I think, that, you know what? We'll just do that. Yeah. Again, as a big nerd, when it comes down to playing both uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG and Pokemon, I, I like, this is this is my zone. This is my kind of game. So we're going to go ahead and hop in and hop into, uh, let's just do a casual match first, right? Yeah, let's just do... You know what? It's too ranked. We ain't no babies around here. We'll run this deck and we'll see how this goes. And we got a match, I think, already, right? That was. I expected matchmaking to take forever, but that was uh, 10 seconds. It even gave you a timer. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, okay, so only medium. And I think this is their first time playing as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to go ahead and skip. Uh, sex cards, you want to change from your open hand? Uh, let's get rid of. Oops. That's not. I meant to actually. Rip, <laughs> I meant to take out one Popo card. So I believe you start with three cards in your hand, and uh, you can exchange cards upon drawing them or something like that. I might be wrong on some of the stuff, like I said, because this is my first time playing, but yeah. Okay, let's see how this goes. Uh, Let's see what this one does. I think we'll just we'll keep it nice and simple. Just summon a uh, Popo and <laughs> end my turn. I put Popo down face down defense mode. I end my turn. Face down defense mode? <laughs> I just told you my card was face down defense mode. Okay, that's my, my turn already? Are they done? Are, can they not summon anything? Probably not. I'm going to just uh, go ahead and put the Kuyu in the field. And I'm going to just attack. 
So the way this works, in case you don't know, you have your attack points, which you see above Mr. Popo, uh, well, the, the blue number, which is 2,000. So when I attack, it deals 2,000 damage, and I have 4,000 HP. It's not like Yu-Gi-Oh, where, you know, uh, if the highest, if two cards clash, the highest card wins. It's HP-based, so it's just like Hearthstone. So if you attack, if Popo takes, uh, gets attacked by something that has 3,000 points, he's going to have 1,000 HP left, if that makes sense. And to actually, to, to deal damage, you have to, um... Attack them directly, so you have to clear out the field. So, yeah, like I said, this, this game is, as much as I was memeing it, it's it's strangely a lot of fun. <laughs> it's a lot of fun. And I can I feel like I can see myself playing this a lot, even just off-stream. Like, off, or not off-stream necessarily, but like off-stream, off-YouTube. Because, again, I love card game videos like this. To me, it's still funny that, oh, this is going to do, what, 7,000 damage to one card? He's, yeah, he's dead. Um, I, 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 li I like games like this, if that makes sense. Okay, so right now, he is stronger than me. He's going to, oh, he can't attack though, because he can't attack with the same card he summoned. You know what? We can do the same thing. We can do the same thing. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, he didn't expect that. Uh, I can't summon anything else. So what I think I'm going to just do is, because I want to speak here to cost us, yada, yada, yada. I'm going to just attack again. And of course, once he gets to uh, zero life points, the game's over. All right, let's see what it can do. It's kind of funny that, you know... We still don't have a drama super card game game online uh, or like a PS4 or Nintendo Switch style game, but we have this. Someone took the time to make this instead of giving us the actual card game that already exists. Okay, I think they just literally let the time run out. I don't know what happened there. Okay, so you'll notice that every single turn you get more key. Now I have four keys, so I can actually do something like, let's see. I can actually activate this, but I think it'll be a waste. Because I don't... What is this? It's three stars or less, right? Yes, it's three costs or less, which means I can either get Yamcha, Tien, and Krillin out, or Bobby and Deborah, which which that's what they actually do. I think what I'm gonna just do is is I'm gonna just I'm gonna summon double Popo. And then I'm gonna attack. And I'm gonna just end my turn. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully they do something, cause I wanna play. Like <laughs> let me play. Alright. So they're doing something. I don't know what the Goten card does. So just draws one card up on summoning. So if you, I don't think he can attack me because his attack is less. I, he can do that though. And he, he can't actually, he can't attack me with either card because he just put them on the field. So this is about to be fun. This is what we can do here. Oh, do I want to save this? I think I'm going to save this. Here's, here's what we're going to do first. I am going to, I'm going to summon this. So up on summoning that, you KO one card. Uh, let's get rid of the, uh, the, the Vegeta. <laughs> I feel like I'm just bullying right now because like and this is something I like about the game I played like twice, you know off of just uh, doing a tutorial and stuff like that It's very easy to pick up. It's like it's mad simple I'm gonna attack again and that should actually uh, kill the Gota and now his, his uh, field is completely just destroyed Next by the way, you'll see I have three energy every time you don't use, use energy It actually goes into reserve so next turn. I'll be able to actually bring out this Goku. So you know what we could actually probably We can maybe win within the next two turns all right, they're doing. Okay, so adds 1,000. Oh, you know what sucks is they're about to get washed. See, this is what I mean. So I'm about to, I'm about to bring this bad boy out. I don't have to use my reserve energy. I'm about to just bring this bad boy out. That's the legendary card I pulled earlier. Oh, I can deal. Hold on, time out. I think I'll deal. Yeah, I'll deal damage directly to them. Oh, this is a spirit bomb. Yo, we got animations. I didn't know that. Okay, now. The question I have is, is if I attack with Cell, yeah, so it kills both. Okay, so we're, we, so now what we can do is we can attack with you and uh, and you. So, so because his attack was higher but his HP was low, basically I, cr I, I we crash into each other. And now I'm in my turn. Oh, and he's playing the same card I was gonna play. That's gonna be a yikes, actually. So yeah, I think we're both just basically running the same deck. Okay, what can I do here? Ooh! See, I'm getting a, <laughs> I'm getting the heart of the cards over here right now. So that's gonna deal seven thousand damage. And uh, when I, when I, can I bring this out still? This is what we can do. We can actually use energy. And then I can bring out. So it uses everything if you do that. I can bring out uh, you. And so if I attack with Pope, Pope, <laughs> yo, Pope over here doing all the damage. Let's go. <laughs> Oh my gosh, yo, imagine getting destroyed by Popo. And then we're gonna do another 2,000 damage to those life points. Ah, oh, they're doing, bro, do we have the same hand? And, okay, so this actually brings all cards, 
Returns all regular character curling Yamcha and Tian cards to your side to filter your hand. They have nothing to, to do. All they're gonna do here is oh, gonna recover some HP. All they're gonna do is probably just do Oh, they can't attack me! I'm still I still got the lead here. Oh, this is about to be great. So your SP cards are like special cards um, that require uh, different like I guess summoning um, like requirements. So like for example, if I activate you know the Roshi card, I can bring one out that's under four or under three. Oh, you can't attack with it directly. Okay, got it, got it, got it. So basically, my uh, my uh, Piccolo 17 card is almost dead. What we got here? Same thing. Let's go ahead and just bring out. Let's activate this. And I guess I can go between these two. Returns all. Yeah, let's do this. So the reason why you want to return a card to your hand is you'll be able to heal it essentially. Because like right now it's damaged, I can bring it back out. You know what? We're gonna be aggressive right now. Let's bring out Kui as well. And the first thing we're gonna do is who can we attack with? Let's attack with you. Oh, did we? No, we didn't win yet. We're we're, get, we're getting up there. We're winning next turn. That's gonna do thirteen thousand to their life points. And then Popo with another two thousand. Let's get it. Like, imagine they have that Frieza. Okay, so no, that actually, that's gonna kill one card. It's gonna kill that one. Smart. He can't attack. No, I still win. Because I have 7,000. Both of these are gonna crash into each other and not be able to finish them off with. Oh, but he wants to do that. It's gonna come out. He can't attack me with it, though. I think I still win. No. Well, actually. No, yeah, I do. I still win. I should still be able to win here. I th let's, actually, no. Uh, they're, <laughs> they're bringing out everything right now, but they can't, they can't really. Uh, they can't do anything. But I got the one card. Oh, chaos! You know what? He is. Oh, this is gonna be so glorious. Okay, I'm not summoning anything. I'm gonna go ahead and attack. Uh, let's get let's get a little bit of this. Uh, let's get rid of. Let's get rid of this. And. Just a quick note for voiceover rhyme. Uh, I didn't actually realize you can attack directly even if they have cards in the field. So the way it works is if they have what's called a guard card, you have to kill those cards first. But since this player didn't have any field, uh, any cards in the field that were guard cards, I could attack directly at any point. But I didn't know that. <laughs> I was thinking like Yu-Gi-Oh where you have to clear out the field first before you can attack directly. So yeah, that's why I don't win in this turn. Just a heads up. On top of that, I wanted to play the Frieza, the legendary Frieza card that I pulled. And uh, well, you'll see how that plays out here in a second. I'm gonna just end. So what's gonna happen next turn is I'm gonna have 10 key and I'll be able to bring out the Frieza I just pulled and win with that. Cause in my mind I'm like, man, I really wish I get that Frieza out so I can actually play it. But this card seems really good. Chaos KOs all characters on the field. 20 26,000 HP? Are we for serious? Alright, so he's probably gonna kill my uh, <laughs> this is a buff. Yeah, go ahead, use up all your key. Use up all your key. Use it. Go ahead. I dare you. Come on, make, make your final move. Why'd you attack that one? Oh, that's why. Okay. I guess I, I guess I kind of agree. It sucks that I can't kill you with, with Frieza here, but this is going to be so glorious. All right. Frieza Summer! Frieza Summer! <laughs> why did it not work? Upon appearance, chaos all cards in the field. Did I do that right? Do I not have... Oh, oh I need to have all the energy for her. Okay, that's good to know. That's very, very good to know. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna crash into you. So how do I get the last bit of uh Oh that's how. Okay, so I have to basically if I can get if I can get that last uh whatever that symbol is, it's basically a type, I think. Uh, which I would get by how do I even get that out in the field? If I can get the last type out, we're gonna win. Man, okay, so that was kind of a misplay. Again, I'm new to the game. But that would have been such a glorious way to end it. And is that upon like drawing it or playing it? That's what I wanna know. Cause I'm not actually sure myself. I mean, go ahead. You can do what you want. You know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're not gonna take out my Freezy Pop. You're not gonna take out my Freezy Pop. You have summoned everything. Yeah, this is gonna be even better for me when I draw that one card to take you out. Also, I just realized he can actually do a lot of damage to me. He can attack me for. Uh, no, actually, wait. Freezy's dead. If he attacks me with both Goku's, which he did. How did he attack? Oh, he's attacking me directly. Uh oh. I just realized you could also attack. I didn't even think about that. I didn't get. I didn't draw the card that I needed. Hold on. I can do this. I can do it again. 
Let's summon it again. Give me the card I'm looking for. I didn't get a single one. <laughs> uh. I mean, I just. You know what? Let's just go all out. I might as well at this point. Wait, why don't you do this? Did it leave? For like my first time playing, I think we'll call this a video. This is, like I said, it's very fun. Like, I, I never expected a game that's a sub, like a sub game within the game to be disinjured. This is more fun than Kakarot. Of course, I also love card games, so that's probably why. But again, if you ever liked Hearthstone, this is a game for you. So yeah, if you want to see the channel again, uh, hit that thumbs up and I got you. I'm not even going to set a like goal. You guys can decide for yourself. But I definitely at least want to, at one point, make a video where I, I face off against Nano. Uh, and then we'll probably call it. We might do this a couple times depending on how well this actually is received on the channel But yeah, don't sleep on it just because it's a card game. It's it's fun. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Rhyme Style, and I'll see you in the next video